Hey guys, it's Luke here. Just wanted to uh, go over really quick. If you've purchased a plan from Final Surge through my coaching page with the structured workout features, I want to show you uh, how to apply that plan and uh, how to see your paces and see them in the uh, structured workout section. So, um, so the first thing you do, so this is, I'm in the beta platform. I think a lot of times people are not in this platform, they're in the, the, the regular platform of Final Search. However, at the time of putting this together, what we're gonna see is, uh, we're gonna see this, this plan I'm just trying to get back to. My calendar, let's go to my calendar. All right, so this is my calendar. Um, so what you would do is, the first thing you would do is wh when you purchase a plan, um, ideally you're, you're walk through an application process of the plan, but I recognize some people are not um, seeing their paces and things. So first thing that I would do is go into workouts, heart rate, power, pace zones. I always put things by uh, pace. Um, but you might do heart rate or power or whatever case you will. These won't line up necessarily, but they will line up for um, for pace. So uh, that's why we're going to just go through that one right now. Um, so we're just going to reset this. So if, if you don't have these in, um, you would want to um, do that. So you're going to, if you, if you first do this and you haven't set these up before, you'll have an opportunity to select heart rate, power, pace. We're doing runs. You can either do kilometers or uh, miles, and then we're going to skip the threshold pace, and we're going to go to Hanson's Marathon Method, um, select a race distance. In this case, I'll just select a marathon. We'll go, uh, we'll just go three hours. Apply that. <clears throat> Update the zones, and then they're all set in there. So uh, that's all we have to do for that part. So then, when you have your training plan, you go to the training plans, view my plans. Um, if you've created plans, you'll see them like this. But every anything that you've purchased will be up top here. I'll say purchase plan. Um, I'm going to just scroll down to we'll go to half marathon plans because I know this one is. Uh, Done. All right, so we're gonna we're going to click the uh, apply plan. And if you know your if you know the race date, you'd put it by the end date. If you uh, know the start date, so we'll just start it next week. Continue. Listen to the giant motorcycle go by. Confirm and apply. And then what we can do is go to calendar. And so now you see I have um, a plan put in. But I don't have any paces. So what we would do is we'd go to the beta. Okay, and so where your structured workouts will be would be you see these little these three little bars here, or you can actually click on the day, go to workout builder, and all your stuff would be in there. Um, and then you can actually go in and edit this. So like if you had an interval workout, we could set this to whatever one. You wanted to because those this is these are the paces from what you set up just previously so um so that's all you'd have to do so uh then that's what would sink into your your garment and things like that so uh that's all you need to do but the biggest thing is you just need to go into the beta platform and we, we debated going and putting the paces in the regular platform but since we're going to be moving everything over to the beta platform with final search anyway uh, we just decided that we might as well just 
start the process and stop adding things to a platform that's going to be not even used um, down the road anyway. So, so that's how you do it. And then uh, you can see all your paces and good stuff there, which is nicer because now you can actually see what intervals will be, what rest recoveries will be, all that good stuff. So, um, so there you have it. All right. Thanks guys. We'll see you.